Welcome to today's edition of TV Wolf. Today is Tuesday, December 6th. It is an A day and a Signet 4 day. Would everyone please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance? I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the Wolf Pack Pledge. I will honor myself and others. I will take ownership for my actions. I will demonstrate an excellent work ethic in all that I do. I am responsible for my own learning. I am responsible to the success of our school. We are tracking a path towards excellence. And now for the moment of silence. Welcome back. Today for lunch we will, having, we will be having build your own burrito or nachos, cilantro and lime rice, corn tortilla chips, flour tortilla, southwest chicken, spicy beef, and baja fish sticks. Today's weather will be rainy with a high of 43 and a low of 38. The girls varsity basketball team played their second game of the season on Friday at Ripon. The girls fought hard in a tough environment and played until the last whistle. The team was up big at the end of the third quarter and Ripon found a way to fight back. A sign of a good team is when you hold off your opponent playing at their best and that is exactly what the Lady Wolves did, winning 19 to 17. Top scorers were Olivia Brooks, 11 points, Bryn Bruchon, 6 points, and Lily Payne, 2 points. Great good job, job ladies. ladies. Attention all SEA offers officers and homeroom representatives. Today at 3 p.m. there will be an SEA meeting. If you, the representative, cannot make it, the alternative must show. An executive from Pennies for Patients, from the Pennies for Patients Association will become here to talk to with us about the upcoming coin drive. Now until Wednesday, February 1st, the Yearbook Club will be holding an art contest. Create an awesome cover to represent your grade, school appropriate, and try to include our school mascot on colors. If you have any questions, please see Ms. Delgadio. All NJHS staff appreciation committee will meet today after school in Ms. Salo's room. Salo's. Salo. What? <laughs> Hashtag Howler Journalism Club will be meeting today after school in room A19. Students interested in applying for the Fine and Performing Arts program at Colgan High School must have their applications in by Wednesday, December the 14th. If you need an application, please talk to Ms. Henry. Students who would like to help with their portfolios for Colgan can stay after school Wednesday, December the 7th and Monday, December the 17th with Ms. Henry. Of oh, the 12th. It's the 12th. Attention 8th graders who are interested in applying to high school specialty programs. Osborne Park High School is having their information session this Thursday, December 8th. If you're interested in the biotechnology and pre-governor school or any other programs that they offer you, you should plan to attend. Also, time is winding down on the application due date for Colgan Center for Fine and Performing Arts programs, which is December 12th. All other applications need to be completed by February 1st. If you have any questions, please see Ms. Proctor Dunn. Are you interested in playing chess? Well, guess what? Our chess clubs will start today directly after school. Are you an amazing speller? Would you like to compete with other super spellers at LR LRMS? Compete at the county level? DC metropolitan area level? Then come, come and, and be a star, star in the Lake Ridge, Ridge Middle, Middle School's, School's first, first annual, annual spelling bee. Please come to the information session on Thursday, December 8th, after school to learn more. Sign up outside Ms. Esmacher's room, C8. Thanks for watching this edition of TV Wolf. I'm Elaine Algart. And I'm Charlotte Flynn. Thanks, Thanks for, for tuning in and have a great day. day.